To configure a giant planet, or a Jovian, first you will need to warp to it. Then click on the configure button in the bottom left corner. In the first tab, you can change the ablateness of the planet and its texture. Rapid planetary rotation leads to an equatorial bulge, producing an oblate spheroid shape. In the second tab, you can change the planet texture's color and its brightness. It is best used with a black and white texture, otherwise the colors may appear unnatural. The parent star's color may also affect the end result, so you may want to also change the parent star to white. The next three parameters are used for the flow of the giant planet, such as speed, strength, and noise tiling. The third tab contains aurora parameters. You can change the aurora colors, brightness, height, and density. If you want to hide the aurora, simply set all of these three parameters to their minimal values. The fourth tab is the Ring Texture tab. If you don't want a ring, keep the texture value set to zero. You can change the texture color, the inner and outer radius, the brightness, inclination, and node values. The fifth and sixth tabs are for asteroids. You can use these along with the ring texture or separately. First, set the number of asteroids to something larger than zero. You can change the colors of the asteroids, thickness of the field, how many of these asteroids deviate from the middle, the asteroid's radius interval, and how much their radius deviates from the median. In the last tab, you can change the orbit of these asteroids and their speed. Now you can save your changes and fly to your planet.